Oh, such a great guy. So good to have Sean back for the 10th season premiere. Now, sometimes stars like Sean come to us, but sometimes we have to go to them. Like when I jetted all the way to the Bahamas to meet up with country star Dirks Bentley at the Atlantis Paradise Island Resort. What a gig you have here yeah. in the beautiful Bahamas. Amazing. Although we're in a freezing cold room right here right now. Yeah, this doesn't feel very Bahamas right now, no. but, uh, but uh, it's, uh, it feels good to be here. And it feels great for his fans too. Dirks kicked off the HGTV Atlantis Live Music Festival this weekend. It's just the latest perk for the country superstar, whose latest single, Drunk on a Plane, is number one on the country charts. Now, is this uh, an obnoxiously Liam Gallagher drunk on a plane, or is this like a happy Betty White drunk uh, on a plane? It's somewhere in between. I think it starts off Betty White and ends up Liam Gallagher, yeah. Dirks obviously has a great sense of humor, but his latest album is mostly made up of personal and emotional material. Yeah. As a songwriter, things happen in my life that um, kind of, you know, just hadn't happened before, the, 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 you know, having a son was really special. Uh, my dad passing away was another big event too, obviously maybe the biggest event, so those kind of wound up in the album. Any reservations about putting yourself out there, your feelings out there on an yeah. album for the whole world? To... Uh, no, man, I mean, I, I think the cool thing about country music is there is a real accessibility with the artists and the fans. So what does Dirks think about Taylor Swift's departure from country in favor of a new full-on pop sound? To me, she's always kind of been just all genres. Right. So I've known her for a long time, since she's probably like 12 or 13, and I'm always just cheering her on, doing whatever she does, she's great.